What's up everyone, Kita Sean here. So it's been a while since I actually made a video for Idola Fantasy Star Saga and to be honest, I hate myself for not making more because I really, really like the game right now. It's currently my favorite mobile game to play and I'm actually planning to make a bunch of Idola videos uh, soon because I'm actually writing scripts right now on character reviews or like spotlight videos like I do with my FGO videos. So uh, look forward to that if you play Idola. And um, I just want to push the game even more. I mean, I'm doing my best on the Facebook groups, the Discord channels. Like, I, I love this game, and I just want everyone to play it. It's just so much fun, and I, I, just, I just like the game. And there is a possibility that this game might come to the States now because of the release of Fantasy Star Online 2. So, uh, yeah, that's actually really exciting, and I, I cannot wait for that as well. But um, we're going to go ahead and do a trailer reaction video to the upcoming summer event. Now, this summer event got leaked not too long ago. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen the video of me just awing over Stella, the swimsuit version. I mean, her design is amazing. Now, uh, we got a bunch of leaks from, the, from that uh, previous leak. But this time, um, we actually got official confirmation that all this is coming uh, earlier today, uh, Fantasy Star Online 2 had its uh, live stream. I wasn't able to watch it because I was at work. And um, they did some Italy news. And they revealed that, yes, a summer event is coming. And here are some characters for this event, some symbols, and uh, some upcoming updates, which is actually very exciting. I'll talk about the uh, UI updates in another video, but we're just going to go ahead and focus on the trailer here. And um, we know that Stella was a playable character or is a playable character, but we didn't know if any other characters were going to be playable. But um, during the live stream, we got a confirmation that Furemi and uh, Windis are going to be playable characters as swimsuits, which is actually very exciting. Now, uh, it kind of, you know, confused me why they pick Windis because, I mean, she recently came into the game. So I really thought it was going to be you know Anne Marie or maybe even uh, Rosalinda I mean they revealed their swimsuit designs and they look amazing so I thought you know they could be playable characters especially Anne Marie I mean she's been in the game since the beginning but um yeah it really threw me off to see that Furemi and Windis are going to be playable characters so uh yeah let's just go ahead and watch the trailer and I'll talk about the characters a little bit and um, again, in another video, I'll talk about the UI updates. So let's just, let's just watch the trailer. This is my first time watching it. So uh, I'm actually really, really excited to see what or how their EBs look like, their elemental blast. So let's check it. Okay, so here we are. We're going to watch the trailer. I'm very excited. So let's watch. Stella Summer looks amazing, both Chaos and Law. So we have Windus Summer. So we've never seen the Law or Chaos forms. They were never leaked, but there it is. So they mean, oh my god, dude, her Law and Chaos form look amazing. So they showed a little bit of the EB, so that's cool. So again, Rosalinda and Anne Marie's design look amazing. Um, I really like Yudi's uh, Yusha shirt. <laughs> I found out that a lot of female players actually play this game, which is crazy. Um, and they want male characters, obviously, in swimsuits. So Nicole recently came in. Uh, Seven uh, is supposed to be uh, the new arena gacha character, so you can get him for free. You just gotta farm it. Oh, they're gonna reveal it! Okay, so these Idomagus are basically uh, mascot characters that basically give you like a, an additional bonus in the quest. Uh, I'm not too sure. I gotta watch the stream to check the full details, but you can level them up and everything like that. There's different rarities, so uh, this is actually really cool. I'm not sure if they're if they're gonna be equipment or anything like that. So, yeah, really excited. And there's gonna be like some new event quests and an arena quest, so that's actually gonna be really exciting. But uh, yeah, that's basically about it. I mean, um, they didn't really show a lot of the EB. I'm pretty sure. Uh, the upcoming uh, Italy news video, which is going to be on the YouTube channel, Popona is going to you know talk about the characters a little bit. They're going to show off the full EB animations. Uh, they're going to talk about more of the events and stuff like that, the quest. So I'm really excited about that. 
Um, but I'm gonna watch the stream as well. I gotta watch the recording. They haven't uploaded it yet, so uh, I gotta wait for that. But yeah, I'm really excited about the summer event. Apparently, there's no release date yet. Uh, we don't know the rarities of the characters yet. I'm assuming all of them are gonna be five stars, and they're all gonna have like their own rate ups, like they did with uh, Shingeki no Kyojin Attack on Titan. So yeah, I'm really excited, and I cannot wait. Uh, very, very excited. But yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Laters.